Well, hello and welcome to the last 2021 Rugby Europe Championship match of the weekend of the month. Georgia then, almost with a perfect record in the 2021 competition, top of the table with 14 points from a possible 15. Romania in second in the table with nine points after two wins and a defeat to Russia. Those listening to our uh, English language feed, some of the audio that we, uh, we are receiving from the stadium has our Georgian language commentary on it. So uh, we will just dip that for you so that uh, Tom May and I can bring you the action. I can't believe you're thinking so cynically. <laughs> <laughs> As if it would happen. It's a massive scrum. It is. There's another advantage. At least the Romanians have stayed up in this one. Georgia are looking to try and play it, looking to try and crash over if Paolo Duarte see the grounding. Either way, he says it's penalty try. It's an instant seven points for Georgia. The front forward dominance showing inside the first 10 minutes of the match. They pick up Tornike Jalagonia, but uh, he's not going to be the one credited with the score. It's a penalty try for Georgia. They lead Romania by seven points to nil. Yeah, there's another perfect scrum, wasn't it, from the Georgians? Christy Bobok made his debut in the last game, the open side. Oh, but it's a penalty to Russia as they get themselves isolated. And it's good. Georgia get themselves up to 10 points. Romania nil. Romania, it's the furthest into Georgian territory they've been. Georgians get a decent shove to begin with, but Romania have... Uh, Got a few metres out of them so far. Now the reinforcements get back. Can the Oaks keep up the pressure on the Georgian line here? Oh, and they break through. And there is the score. Romania get the try. Just after Georgia lose Mamukashvili to the bin. The Oaks punish them with the score. They work their way straight back into this game. Nicely done. Shorter ball. Look to try and send Gigashvili around the corner. Now the ball back inside. Sharikadze takes a few metres. Georgia knocking on the door once more. Romania, no doubt, keen to identify a moment. There's a bit of a ruckus going on off the ball, and Paolo Duarte is going to have to stop play here. This is the moment. It's very borderline late, isn't it? He's committed to the hit. Yeah. I think it's just the, the bit of afters as well. Number. Oh. 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 Romania into the midfield. They've just met the big frame of Karakadze there. He's tried to hold them up, but there was a penalty advantage being played for offside. Jordan certainly showing no respect for the kicker. You wouldn't expect them to either in Tbilisi. But Florin Vlaiku has absolutely no problem slotting that three-pointer. So Georgia 13, Romania the first to add points in the second half up to 10. Prasudze. Amjan A little bit more depth. Looks to try and make a man and ball tackle on Knaladze. But now it's just ended up creating the extra man on the outside where the space appears. It's that man, Saginadze, who's been so strong. Looks to try and smuggle the offload away. It's a brilliant try from Georgia. The support was there just in time. But you have to think it was made by Becker Saginadze, who's been on fire this game so far and turns, becomes provider for the try. Absolutely brilliant from Georgia. And now Abjan Dadze with a tough conversion effort. Oh my word. Superbly done. From a Romanian perspective, it's the line out that has got to go first. They get that right. Brought down by Adrian Motsok. Now here they go. Have Georgia got an answer to it? My goodness, look at the pace of it. Sensational drive and score. No debate from Paolo Duarte. That was one-way traffic. And it looks like Eugen Capazzina is the man who's uh, 
being awarded the score. It's an easy enough effort for a man of his class. So, Georgia 20, Romania 17. Oh, it's a penalty, Georgia. And that proceeds, it does go quickly. He was on the mark that time, now plays it away. It's going to be a try in the corner for Tabit Sadze. Georgia looked to have stolen a third try. And could it prove decisive in this fixture? Well, that's all about the work from Aprasidze. You could tell Romania have been worried about what he's going to do. Conversion is not successful. Georgia. Well, they've decided to go for the drop goal, which is successful. From the foot of Georgi Babakashvili. It is a final three points that just drives the knife in a little further it won't be a fourth try and a bonus but it will be a win by 11 points the Meski stadium is full of cheering fans as the Lelos make it a fourth successive Antim Cup win